Interest ride for a teenager and four small children all riding together in a golf cart in a Palmetto Bay neighborhood when they were hit by a car. Local 10 News reporter Andrew Perez has our story. You know, we spoke to the driver of that car tonight. She says she tried to avoid this accident. Afterwards, her car goes off the road. It goes right into this fire hydrant over here. She says right now she is just hoping that these kids make a full recovery. Oh, it was chaos. It was panic. It was a race to rescue children. When I got there, the little kid was all bloody and, and having difficulty breathing. She came out crying and in panic, and I, I just drove her over there. Neighbors catching the terrifying moments after a golf cart full of children crashes in the middle of the street. You see the bright markers on the ground, the golf cart over on its side. And right next to it, this Dodge with some serious damage to the bumper and the windshield. The golf cart was struck and did flip over. All of the occupants were ejected. It happened as families and friends gathered for the 4th of July. The Dodge was traveling north on Southwest 79th place in Palmetto Bay. Police say the golf cart ran a stop sign at 170th Street. A 16 year old was driving that golf cart and she had four younger children with her. The youngest, a two year old. <laughs> We spoke to the driver who didn't want to show her face, but she said she freaked out when it happened. She said she got out of work and the kids just came out of nowhere. That 16 year old driver was transported in critical condition along with a 12 year old who was taken to Nicholas Children's Hospital. So it's unclear right now exactly how fast both of these vehicles were going. We know that both of these children, they are still recovering at the hospital. We will keep you updated. For now, reporting in Palmetto Bay, I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.